Well, with any new school year comes new and exciting initiatives, especially if you're going to college, right? Yeah, and this year is no different at the University of Maine. New Center Maine's Carly Dion has the details on a new venture combining art with science. Nanocellulose is a material composed of more than 95% water. It's a malleable substance that looks similar to a yogurt or paste. Now, you Maine Intermedia Studies students are using this material to combine art creation with research. You Maine graduate students working with nanocellulose say it's a non-toxic and environmentally friendly material to experiment with. They're hoping to use their art to help scientists learn more about it. The material is produced right at UMaine's Process Development Center, and it's one of the only facilities in the country to produce it by the pound. Graduate students Alex Rose and Augusta Sparks Farnham say they're hoping people will start to shift their perspective of only viewing art as what she calls window dressing. So if I can play with the colors of the natural dyes that are then integrated into the nanocellulose, sort of to make a sensory table of sorts, basically be able to integrate the colors, play with them together, just welcome people yes of special needs but also those who aren't just to play with the material introduce the material to new people we want to maintain a seat at the table and we have a different way of talking and a different way of showing you things that we're seeing that it's relatable content um and perhaps you know it's a reframing of sorts right so we may bring something forward that you had that somebody else hadn't thought of yet their work will be on display in part of a gallery talk on campus coming up on September 13th. If you're interested in learning more, I'll have more details posted on our website and mobile app. Carly Dion, News Center, Maine.